Hi everybody and welcome back. Today we're going to be talking about how to get the stun button. So we need to head over to Halt Town, into the mansion, and you can see here it's a Chalk Peak. Now you might have been here before, it's a really big mansion, lots of places, lots of loot to collect. However, if you go down the manor here into this office, you'll notice that there's a lift. It doesn't quite look like it should be there. As you can see, you need an access card to gain entrance, but this actually is the exit, not the entrance. So in order for us to get the stun button blueprint, we do need to get the mystical crate from here. Now, I don't know if you can get this in any of the other places. I have looked in all of them. This was like my last stop. And this is where I found it. So if you found the stun button blueprint before this by looking in other mystical cool crates in Chalk Peak, great, I love that. Maybe let me know in the comments. However, this is the only place I've been able to find it myself. So I'm just having a bit of a nose here to see if there's a shortcut. Unfortunately, there wasn't for me. <laughs> so I'm going to just go through the main entrance and just head straight over to the elevator. Upon entering the museum, you'll see a lot of enemies just having a nice little snooze on the floor and they tend to stay there. You can't really hit them for damage, anything like that. But there is lots of loot in here and some chest crates. So do recommend having a little look. However, when you do click to go into the elevator, the alarm does go off and all the enemies wake up. So prepare for a fight. Big tip here as well is that when you do get into the elevator or lift, as we call it in England, do make sure to press start because if you don't, you'll be sat on the ground floor with an alarm going off. I totally didn't do that. The second you get out of the lift, you can see this big yellow corned off area, but you do need an access card to gain entrance. It's actually in here where you'll find your mystical crate. So let's go ahead, let's spend two seconds and find the card. The access card for once is very easy to find. As soon as you come out of this yellow area, take a left and then turn the corner to the right hand side. On that table, right at the end of the table where you're standing, there's the access card. So pick it up. Take a nice little run back over to the yellow area I just showed you and then activate the access card. Now there will be enemies in here and egg sacs so you do need to kill a lot of things and be careful. Them spiders do in fact hold gas canisters which go kaboom. To avoid you having to watch my painful gameplay I have in fact sped up this fight bit but as you can see this is where the mystical crate is. In that crate will be the blueprint for your stun button and here you can also see there's a lift. If you take that lift, as you can see, it will take you straight back into that office where we first started, which is pretty much where everybody goes and looks and gives up. But there you have it. So what we're going to do now is teleport back onto our base. So when we're back at base, we're going to go ahead and find our blueprint for the stun button and we're going to fuse it. By doing this step, we are making it available for us to go ahead and build that weapon. Don't forget, if this is going to become a weapon of choice, you can enhance it to make it even stronger. So here I am standing conveniently, ready to go ahead and build it, as if I knew this is exactly what I was going to do. So if I go to the melee and then go ahead and build my stun button. You can build this at any tier, they will all work. However, I've built this as a tier 5 to make it my weapon of choice for a little while. Don't forget you can calibrate it, enhance it, all that kind of stuff, as well as adding mods. And there it is. Thanks a lot for watching everybody, that was absolutely stunning.